Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and uh, we are in a little bit of a pickle here. Uh, I have been transporting my stuff from my old base to my new base, and I thought I had enough gas uh, to get back there in the motorcycle, and I didn't. So we ran out of gas, and we're not quite there yet. And um, so, yeah, uh, I thought I'd bring you back at this point because things might get a little exciting here as we try and figure out what we're going to do about this situation. Uh, I, I And I'm completely out of gas, too. Um, so once we kind of get back to the base uh, and get the motorcycle back to the base and whatnot, uh, or we might have to just sneak over there ourselves and grab the mini bike and go find some more gas. Excuse me, before we can do anything else. So anyway, that's where we're at. And we're going to try and do that without getting killed along the way, which is going to be easier said than done. Uh, also, I'm having a really bad beard day, so I have the camera turned off. I'm actually uh, going to go in later today uh, to the barber and have my, get my beard uh, trimmed and get the haircut and stuff because my son's actually getting married next week. Today is May the 20th. Uh, you guys will be watching this um, a lot later. Um, so anyway, yeah, all th there you go. <laughs> so no camera today. Uh, all right, let's see if we can get this done here. So uh, we uh, the other problem that I currently have is... I'm almost out of 556s. Now I do have my oh shit. I do have my crappy uh AK on me. Uh he's oh uh, shit, he's feral too. Of course he's feral. Alright, let's just run for it. Um Let me see if I have uh Yeah, I need some I need something to Yeah, here, let's take these. And let's take these, or this, to keep our stamina up. And uh, see if we can just... Uh, all we have to do is get back to our place here. Um, and then I can get the mini bike out, and then we can use the mini bike to go get some gas for the motorcycle. That's the plan anyway. Come on, stamina. Thank God I got those uh, fort bites, man. Okay. So the Zombos have been fighting me tooth and nail this whole frickin' time. Um, they've just been blowing the shit out of everything down here. Uh, but as you can see, I set up a ladder system here in the elevator shaft. And I had a, a chest down below that I could load. And then, you know, once you're on a ladder, um, you're, not, you're not encumbered on the ladder. And then I just climb up the ladder and then offload into these chests before I put stuff away. Um, yeah, so the zombies have been just fighting me tooth and nail. Every time I come with a load, I got to fight them off. Um, so it's been a bit of a hassle. But anyway, let's, uh, let's jump up into here. I have, uh, um, I'm, I've decided, uh, to use two rooms to start with anyway. So this upper room is going to be our kitchen, our living area, and possibly our, you know, we'll put the Kim bench and stuff up there. And then this is going to be our main crafting room down here. So I've set up these crates here. Uh, built a carpenter's table just on this end because I needed to make some ladders. I've got a lot of repairing to do over here. Um, but yeah, I've just been moving stuff. I'm not even, I don't even have it organized right now. I'm just moving it and putting it wherever. And then I'll worry about organizing it once I get it all here. So let's go ahead and put all of this stuff in here. Just whatever we'll stack. And then I have the mini bike here. So we'll grab that out. And then take it out and get some gas for the motorcycle so we can get it back up and running and get the next load over here. So, okay. So what I want to do is uh, find a chest that's not completely full yet. On the Okay, here we go. So I'm just going to put all this stuff in here. <clears throat> like I said, I'm not, I don't care. At this point, what is where, we'll worry about organizing it later. Uh, this is all food and medical stuff, so we'll take that upstairs. Got a couple of fridges up here for storing that. Not that I need them, but it's just fun. It's for fun. Uh, okay, can we put anything in here? We still have two more items. Oh, and I found this um, in a car or in some trash or something. I wanted to save it, show you that on camera. So now we know how to make pumpkin cheesecake. Let's put the herbal antibiotics in there. Um, I think we know how to make blueberry pie, right? Yeah, because the 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 blueprint is is not lit up anymore. So we already know how to make that. We don't need to hang on to this. 
And I need to eat anyways. And we'll put the eggs in there. Okay, so we got some bacon and eggs in here too. Let's just eat. Do we need to? Yeah, let's eat one of those. And between those two, that should get our uh, food back up. And let's also take one of these. Okay, so yeah, name of the game right now is get gas. That's what we got to do. So one of these should have the mini bike in it. I got to remember which one I put it in. It's not in there. Uh, right here. Okay, can I carry that? Yeah, I can carry it. It's a bit heavy, but I can carry it. Why don't we get um, a couple of gas cans, too? I don't want to take a ton of those because those are also heavy. And I'm going to... I think I'm just going to... What is this? Yeah, that's all 762. Let's take a full stack of 762. And I'm just going to have to burn a repair kit to repair this weapon because it's um it's pretty damaged. Uh, okay, so uh, I think we have everything we need to go get gas. So let's put this down on our toolbar. Uh, well, actually, we want to put this on the toolbar first because that's what we got to drop. And then we'll head down and start looking around for some gasoline. Yeah, it is just a constant struggle with these guys. I don't have any pipe. Do I have any pipe bombs left? I don't. So what we're going to do is run out here, put that down, and then get the hell out of Dodge. Okay, so let's go. I'm going to have a ton of repairing to do, too, once I start getting this situated. I've already done that gas station, so let's just start driving around and looking for any place we can get a hold of some gasoline. I'm going to seriously be thinking about prioritizing well, there's two big, big, very important things that we need. We need the cement mixer um, for Horde Knights, uh, well, and for everything else that we need it for. And, and we need to be able to make gas. Um, so those two things are, like, at the top of our priority list right now. Yeah, this wasteland is just brutal. I mean, it always is, right? But... I don't know if it's Undead Legacy or my settings, but it's just relentless, man. I don't get a break. <laughs> I just don't get a break in this place. It's, it, You know, it's like in the forest biome, there is, you know, every once in a while things quiet down and the zombies leave you alone and you can get stuff done, but it's just, it's like nonstop around here. All right, let's go over that way. Uh, I don't have a ton of gas in the mini bike either, so we have to be cognizant of that. Is there a zombo in here? There's nothing in here. Okay. And you know, this because this is undead legacy, uh, getting gas is not easy. You can't just go up to a car and wrench it and get a whole bunch of gas cans. So that makes things fun too. That makes things fun too. So uh, where are we going to find gasoline cans? You, It's not likely we're going to find a lot of that kind of thing in houses, so we need shops. This is the gun store. I heard a bird. Is it that one there? Yeah, it must be that one there. So, you know, obviously we're gas stations, uh, car shops, that sort of thing is going to be our best bet for gas. But let's just kind of look over here. Kill that dude. Anything in here? Gas-wise. No. I know there's a, a crate behind there, but I'm not worried about that right now. That's not the priority. All right. Let's hop on here. I debated whether or not I should use the bicycle, but I don't really want to ride around on the bicycle in the wasteland for what I hope are obvious reasons. <laughs> okay, this is the drive-in. Eat a sledgehammer, asshole. Um, there might be gasoline in here, but... 
I don't know. It's going to probably be too much hassle to try and find it. we got to find a, a place that's going to be a little more of a quick, you know, run and grab kind of thing. There's probably gas in the barns. I'd even consider using the mini bike to transfer the stuff, but it doesn't have any storage in it is the problem. Are those gas cans over there? No, those are some kind of red crates. What about inside of this uh, garage here? Are you coming or not? Come here. Let's look in here. No gas, uh, but there is some food. Okay, we'll take that. Let's look inside of this garage. Come here, dude. Okay. Um, I guess... Oh! There's a lot of dudes in there. Oh, I don't have any bobby pins on me. Shit. I don't know if I want to open this place up. Goodness gracious. Well, I guess they can open the door for us. Let's let them do it. And help them out a little bit. Yeah, this is a bit of a problem. They're going to break through. This guy's going to come over here and be a pain in the ass. Okay, he's dead. Get out of here, Fido. Ain't got time for this. Here comes Arlene. No, Edgar, don't be doing your crawling bullshit. Oh, are those? Oh, those are five, five, sixes. Nice. That's what we need. Okay, any gas in here? There's a mo power. No, doesn't really appear to be. Well, let's see what's in here since we're in here. Powered reinforced drawbridge. Yeah, what the hell? Let's learn it. We might want to start making use of stuff like that once we get established in the base. What's up here? Not really anything. Oh, there's some books. Oh, passing gas. This is good. Um, This might give us something really good, actually. Like a vehicle supercharger. Nice. Okay, that will scrap. And we got fat loots, too. Well, that wasn't too impressive. We'll take that stuff, though. Okay. Um. Alright, well, no gas, unfortunately, but we did find some nice stuff, so can't complain. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking, man. There's gotta be gas. This is a freaking city. There's gotta be gas somewhere. Don't get stuck. Probably the first thing we should do when we find some gas is fill the mini bike back up because it's getting low too. Um, that's uh, that's Bob's bores. Is there gas there? 
trying to remember if there's gas like my dog's get, getting hurt on the the barbed wire see I don't have I don't have time to go through an entire POI just to find some freaking gas we got to find something quick it's getting late in the day too all right is there a way to get in this building or do we have to break it open Okay, there's a passing gas crate in the car. Let's just check them. Doesn't anybody keep gasoline in their freaking garage these days? Okay, let's check these crates. Oh, there's some gas. And what is this? Shock absorber. I think we need, we'll need that for the dune buggy. So let's learn it. Okay, so we found a little bit of gas. Okay, I'll grab that stuff. Well, I'll tell you what then. Maybe what we'll do is let's go back to the motorcycle and put the gas in that we found and see if that's enough to get it back to the base. Okay, we're back at the motorcycle. Let's fill it up. And yeah, that gives us a little over a quarter of a tank. Now, can I... Take this and still, yeah. Uh, okay, so let's get the uh, motorcycle back to the base. And then we'll uh, figure out our next move here. We want to stay away from the bears. Absolutely want to stay away from them. Yep. Welcome to uh, the last uh, several in-game days. This is the kind of bullshit I have to put up with. You know, I'm complaining about it, but the fact of the matter is... I shouldn't be because... I decided... I made the decision... To live in the most dangerous biome... In the game... To get to the fat loots, and so... I should expect resistance like this. All right, let's get this repaired. Uh, the other thing that these guys have been doing is they can actually get on this ladder sometimes and climb up here. So I don't know if that's an undead legacy thing or a vanilla Alpha 20 thing. We have to clear them out, though, or there's no way we're going to be able to transport all of our stuff up the ladder. Okay, we thinned them out a little bit. Oh, shit. That's a screamer. That's not good. All right, you know what? That is not good at all. Time to go. Well, all right. Shit. Maybe what I should do is... Why don't we park the motorcycle... ...close to the base and continue on with the... With the mini bike, um, looking for more gas. I think that's probably our best 
choice of action here because it's way too hot there now. Um, and, you know, they're not going to go away either. I'm going to have to, to pull them away, but it might take a while. Especially with that damn screamer around. And I really don't like that bear over there. Is that buzzard coming this way? Okay, well, yeah, I think that's probably what we need to do, except for we are freaking out of daylight, man. That is not good either. Oh, look at that. We need that. That was a nice find. Of course, I don't know if we can make it. What do we need to make a ratchet? Oh, just a normal workbench. Oh, yeah, we can do that. We need this for uh, the, the Tier 2 workbench. Okay, that was a good find, actually. That was a really good find. Okay, well, I think, guys, at this point... Uh, we need to... Uh, well, all right. It, it's too. It's actually too late for me to go out and look for gas. So let's see if we can pick off um, these enemies... Enough for us to at least get up into the base, because we need to be up in that base by nighttime. Um, I'm just a little nervous about the screamer. I don't know where she's at. I hear her. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No bears. All right, let's just do this. Let's just get in here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's just... Whoops, where am I? Let's just get up to the top of the building. There's, there isn't anything. We don't have enough time to do anything else tonight anyway. And once we get all the way up here, we're kind of out of range, and then they lose track of us. But they they don't usually go away. But they might, you know, disperse by the morning. So I'm just going to spend the night here uh, up in the base. Uh, I might, I don't know, I might try and do some organization because, I mean, I don't have, there's nothing else I can do at the moment. So I might try and organize some of these chests, I guess. And then, uh, how much time do we have? Yeah, we're, I think I'm probably going to wrap up the episode here. I, I mostly wanted to bring you guys back just to kind of give you an update on where I'm at and just show you what an enormous pain in the ass this, <laughs> this is, man. <laughs> Trying to move all of our stuff over here. It's just, like I said, it's a constant fight. And that's okay. I mean, like I was saying earlier... We made the choice, well, I made the choice to live here, and so, you know, I made my bed and we got to sleep in it, and we will. We will get to the point where we will also rule the wasteland, except for zombie bears. We'll never rule them. Anyway, um, <laughs> so, yeah, I think we're going to cut things short here, a little shorter episode than normal, but uh, just wanted to give you an update. So I'm going to keep doing this, you know. I'm, I'm going to keep at it until I get everything over here, get my workstation set up, and, um, you know, you guys pretty much know now what the plan is uh this is the upper areas are going to be our kitchen and living area and chemistry area probably and then down below will be the crafting room and the storage area so that is the plan and then once i get that all set up and get established and situated and whatnot i will bring you guys back uh and then we will continue on with the series so hope you guys enjoyed the episode if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch you in the next episode Bye bye